Hi folks, I know it's been a while since my last video, but I just wanted to come back very, very quickly and just show you a couple of things at the post. Um, I've just cut the grass. I've also cut this upper bit of fence off because the farmer doesn't really keep sheep in the field anymore, so there's no real reason to have that. Um, unfortunately, the cows have broken the fence. I don't know if, yeah, there you go. So I'm gonna to have to get a new bit of derail to fix that. Um, I had a couple of kids at the post the other day. I saw them on the CCTV camera and we're, we've lost a bit of paint. Um, I bought myself a couple of fancy 4G antennas. So I'm testing them at the moment. Um, there's one I have up there at the moment. Now, there's a couple of mobile phone antennas. Um, I'm gonna put a little map up on the screen so you can see them. There's one pretty much about half a mile that way. There's one at the motorway over that direction, um, about a mile and a half. And there's one about a mile that way as well. And they're all on the three network and that's what I'm using. And using this antenna and this 4G modem, I'm getting the speed that you can see on the screen now, which I think is pretty satisfactory, especially if you want to, you know, do live streams or, you know, watch the internet or whatever when you're staying here. And it'll also be good for the um, communication system I have down there. So I'm going to test this one first. Uh, and then I'll test this one here just to uh, see if I'm getting similar results. And then I can uh, I can use this for something else. So yeah, quick jump cut and I'll swap over to the other antenna. Okay, so I did a second speed test uh, with this antenna here. And I got very, very similar results. They're on the screen now and they are very similar. Obviously this one is a directional. This is an omnidirectional. This is a directional antenna and this is gonna be faster. So this could be picking up a completely different antenna to this. This could be picking up one four or five miles away. This could be picking up one a mile away. Now, I wasn't sure what this antenna was over the trees here. Um, so it could be a three antenna. I, I really don't know. It could be Virgin, it could be, well, Vodafone. I think use Virgin used Vodafone. So I don't know what it is, but I want to do a little bit more investigating. Uh, this one is getting 53 dB, which is really, really good. This one is getting 67 dB or minus 67 dB and minus 53. So there might be a little bit of adjustment on this, you know, uh, left or right a couple of degrees really makes a difference with a directional antenna. So I'll do a few more little tests and uh, get it as good as I can. And then we will go down into the bunker and we'll do a test from below ground. Okay, we're below ground now and there we are all connected. Let me just focus that. There we are all connected. Now, I have actually went and I've replaced all the cabling. Um, the, the cable that was in here before it was really, really thin. So hopefully you can see the cable I've replaced it with is really thick. Um, I think it's RG58 cable and that has been replaced all the way up the shaft. Um, there's the cable there, really, really thick cable. So um, the cable that's on the top to the antenna is seven meters, then it's four meters down into the post. So we're gonna get some signal loss. So if I had uh, minus 53 dB um, originally, uh, that is now down to minus 59, or sorry, 79 dB. So there's quite a lot of signal loss just over that amount of cable. Uh, so what we want, you know, we're gonna lose quite a bit of speed there with that. Obviously, if you're doing it on the surface with a really short run of cable, um, it's not going to be too bad. But, well, unfortunately, just that's what it is. Uh, we're losing signal. So I have uh, done a speed test. and That is on the screen now. As you can see, we have lost a fair bit of speed, um, both sort of download and upload. But, I mean, it's still, it's still good enough to be watching YouTube and to be, you know, doing stuff like that there. So if you are camping in the bunker, uh, you'll be able to do it and you'll be able to sit on the internet and do whatever you need to do. Uh, the Teletalk system, that will all work eventually when the warning system is sort of connected online, which we intend to do, that will all work as well. There's more than enough speed for that. So for an open day, there's more than enough speed to be running the Teletalk network, which is all that really is used in an open day. So yeah, I've got all the new cable done. I've got this done. Um, I need to do now is do some repainting, which I'm not going to do today because I've no paint with me, but I need to do, and as you can see, it's also five past eight. So I need to start do repaint. I need to fix the fence uh, where the wood is broken. So I need to repair all of that. 
and I need to tidy up where I cut the fence. I need to put a few more uh, clips on just to hold the fence a bit tighter so that the cows don't totally destroy it. But yeah, getting that derail fence fixed, that's top priority. I need to get that done ASAP. So yeah, apologies for the sort of lack of uploads recently. I have a family member who is very, very ill and it leaves me very, very little time outside work to actually get to the bunker. So um, unfortunately that will have a detrimental effect that there will be sort of very few uploads for the foreseeable future. I'm, I'm gonna try my best, but um, it just, uh, it might not be possible. So don't be expecting too much content, which I'm really, really sorry about, but it's, it's totally out of my hands. Um, but yeah, short and sweet video today. I just wanted to show you the sort of the new wiring and the new the new router that I've got, which is also Wi-Fi 6. Um, I'll give you a close-up of it. It's also a Wi-Fi 6 4G router. So it uh, is a heck of a lot faster and uh, a great little modem. But yes, folks, uh, listen, as always, thank you very, very much for watching. And uh, hopefully I'll see you all again next time. Bye-bye.